Let's count down the top 10 rides at Six Flags New England. Number 10 Flashback. There is no better way to start off our list than to take a trip back on ourselves with DC's very own Flash. Good or bad, however, depends on how you find the first half of this adventure. Because unlike such normal coasters as Wicked Cyclone or Superman the Ride, where you will get to experience those many drops, turns and inversions only once after you have made it to the tippy top of the second lift hill, not only will you go back through it all again, but you guessed it, this time completely backwards, hence the name Flashback and the reason I'd always suggest watching this one before taking it on. Number 9 Thunderbolt As much as I love all these modern day coasters, nothing will ever be the sensation of a classic wooden coaster and with this bowl still keeping its charm over 80 years since its original strike, in fact a fantasy for its theme park back in 1929, it totally deserves a spot on our list. And for anyone who possibly does not enjoy that classic wooden sensation like me, then still do not write this one off. Due to its family full out, you can still enjoy those many laughs, smiles and definitely screams throughout its one and a half minute duration with the majority of your group. Number 8 Supergirl Starflyer Have you ever wanted to soar through the air like Supergirl? Yes? Well then look no further, a state of the art sky flyer machine that through the use of centrifugal forces and some super crazy speeds will slowly rise you and your group into the sky until you are completely spinning upside down seven stories high. Saying that though there are many other super rides at the park and with this flight being very very common all around the universe you need to. Therefore if I was visiting on a busy day I would complete all of the more unique adventures that you cannot take on anywhere else. Number 7 The Riddler's Revenge Let me give you a riddle. If you choose to take on this SLC you will be in endless pain. Yet if you decide to watch from ground level then you will sure be okay. Well I don't know if that is so much a riddle rather than a fact but if you go I was trying to hint at this world class inverted coaster i.e. dangly leg one at times can be very rough resulting in what I like to call a Marmite experience where some heroes will come off accepting the Riddler has defeated them for good whereas others can sustain the 50 miles per hour shakiness and enjoy the riddle for what it truly is. Number 6 The Joker 4D Free Fly Coaster From flying with Supergirl to being chucked around by the Riddler, I think we are starting to tell that Six Flags New England has definitely got some crazy rides. However, in my eyes, the Joker's purple and green marble run star experiment takes simply the word crazy to a whole new level. Don't believe me though? Then just watch the test subjects opposite you, cause amongst all of the spinning and flipping along your way down to the bottom, every single gondola on this ride will be facing inwards, meaning that your reactions can and most likely will become memories that are joked about forevermore. Trust me. Number 5 Harley Quinn Spin Sanity it is time to experience a DMV's tallest, fastest and by far most extreme pendulum ride as smashing its weight into the park's lineup only a few years back is anything but your charter swing set and whilst hearing such stats or even watching it fly over your head may make you feel prepared for its hair raising evil spin, Harley Quinn is whom we're talking about here and therefore that sensation of the 70 miles per hour wind rushing past your faces as you lot swing from side to side to next to each other cannot prepare you for, although also when experienced will never ever be forgotten. Number 4 Scream Now as you can only guess by the name 
our next attraction on our list will have the majority of you screaming, cause no matter if it's launching to 20 stories in the air, at a speed faster than a descent, pausing with nothing but a sheer drop underneath you, or simply plummeting down to earth in only a few seconds, one of these three unique towers are sure to leave you draw dropped, quite literally, plus a thing to know before you go, if you manage to take the plunge during the night, be sure to pick the tower which stops at the top the longest, as where the thrills do lack, the views 100% makes up for. Number 3 Batman The Dark Knight I honestly do not know what is more insane, the fact that we are placing them top notch being them flawless at our number 3 spot, or that Six Flags has a Batman inspired ride that for once is not identical to the other 12 clones. Nevertheless, what definitely is not insane is choosing to join the Dark Knight himself on his most daring mission yet, because I do not know why, but the five high speed inversions, amongst all other aspects that you will encounter throughout your flight, becomes a whole lot more super when there is no floor underneath you especially at the front of the car. Number 2 Superman The Ride After our last few adventures, we are going to need to fly alongside Superman for things to get much cooler, which surprise surprise, we are just about to do in the coolest way possible, as every single aspect of this experience, from of course soaring around the 5400 feet of props, effects and serious over their time, to the anticipation of climbing up a theme song playing lift hill will give you those Krypton chills, and leaves only one question remaining, can you brave this challenge, or rather stick with the less superheroes for the time being? Comment down below. Number 1 Wicked Cyclone Where could I possibly begin when discussing our favourite ride at the park? previously known as the New England Cyclone, and now blowing guests away in ways that have never been seen before, with its wooden steel drops, turns, airtime, upside down hang time, etc. There is not one moment of this RMC that will not leave you on the edge of your seats. Plus as our final Tom tip before we move on, leave plenty of time for this one of a kind coaster, because in addition to its pretty long queues, once it's just not enough time to truly appreciate its beauty. Thank you all for watching, bye bye.